climbing another ladder. Welcome back to another video. We are at another store. About to change out some condenser fan motors. On these old Lennox units right here. Got the plug on there. Third. Third four sixties. So that one and alright, I'm gonna go get the motor real quick. I'll be right back. Alright ladies and gentlemen. Got the motor. That's a third horsepower 460 single phase. So we're gonna go ahead and swap this one out. So I'm gonna use this box to stand on it. First things first, we're also gonna change the fan blade, so I'm not too worried about it. So, got our capacitors right, branches, so you got to take that, that bolt right here off and everything will come right off of it. So we're going to go ahead and loosen it, make sure we're going the wrong way. Alright guys, so we're getting this nut off, that'll keep it on there. And then there's a plug down here, which we're going to take off right there. And then, which should come out smoothly. Three hours later. Got it out. So basically that plug was in the way a little bit. So I'm gonna grab our new motor right here. Boom, look at that. Beautiful, brand spanking new, beautiful motor. Steps to walk real quick because I am short. Put this new motor in. Boom, right there. Get your plug. plugs in one way
boom, right there. Put these little clips back in. Here's your ground. Grab your bolt. Slide it through. Like that. I'm gonna take off my glove for this. Right there. Don't drop the nut. Screw it back in. And once you get it nice and tight, then you can, I, I, I do that, that way the blade's not in the way. Then we're gonna grab our new fan blade. And you're gonna see the rotation of it. You can always match it back to the old one. It'll be the same thing. Basically, always the nut goes facing up, easy accessible. So, there we go. That's perfect. And you're gonna wanna line it up perfect. And you always wanna see how high the blade goes out. So we got about a quarter, half quarter of an inch from the top. Quarter of an inch. We'll do about right there. It's always easier to change the blade with the condenser motor, but sometimes you can't do that, you know. It's just the look of the draw. Sometimes you gotta reuse the same blade, which that's why they make pullers. So invest in a good puller. So look at that, beautiful right there. It's not hitting anything. I'm gonna put this grill back on and then we're gonna change the capacitor and turn it on and see. Make sure it's blowing the right way. So we're gonna go in this here. We're gonna look for the capacitors, which are back there. Ooh, okay. All right guys, so we got it back in there. All right guys, so now we're gonna put it back in test mode. I'm gonna hit shift. Unit test. Two dip switches right there. And it's gonna say CO1. We want to test both fans and compressors. So say C11. Then you hold the button down for about five seconds. And you'll hear both compressors come on. And both fans are on. Both are extracting heat. She's ready to go. Swapped out two condenser fan motors on these old Linux units. That's one motor, that's the other motor. We're gonna go ahead and lower them down off of the roof, clean up. And then we'll be out of here.